Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to day two of the pest update. And my goodness, I've been lucky. Uh, what you guys are going to see today is a continuation of basically me playing for the rest of the day yesterday after yesterday's upload. And my goodness, has my RNG been ridiculous. The stuff I've gotten, literally over like a quarter of a billion coins worth of drops if I was on a regular profile. So you guys aren't going to want to miss this one. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe while you guys are here. Without further ado... Let's jump into the madness that was the continuation of day one of the pest update. Super quickly though, if you do find yourself checking on the Hypixel store for the fire sale, the brand new barn skins, or anything else that the Hypixel store has to offer, don't forget to use my career code code ZACK, that's Z-A-C-H, just like my name. You'll save 5% on checkout if you use my code, which is uh, honestly a W. And let me know in the comments down below if you guys are taking advantage. Shout out to everyone who uses my code, you guys are amazing. Without further ado, let's jump right into today's episode. Ooh, okay, starting today off with our first moth, I believe. I don't think I've gotten the moth before this, so this this is pretty cool uh yeah there we go moth one awesome what's the rng drop from this bad boy we have the wriggling larva what is that oh i think that's one of the uh reforges for this thing but the bad reforge right uh wait wriggling larva no this is beady eyes and clipped wings what is a wriggling larva what is that what does that do i have no idea slash hex uh is it wriggling larva this is the bookworms things. What is a wriggling larva? I've never heard of that item. I'm so confused. Ooh, okay. Wriggling larva, I forgot. This is the thing that is a consumable uh, under miscellaneous. Yeah, so uh, you basically need to consume five of these. Each one gives five skyblock XP, and it increases your pest chance, I'm pretty sure. So pretty cool. We're definitely going to need some of those. That's something we're going to have to grind out as well. See, it's so cool because, like, every single pest gives RNG drops that, like, we need besides rat pet i do have a rat pet already i got it really early on before they destroyed the drop chance from rats in the hub but um still cool that you can get it from there i'll take another one why not but yeah all other nine i need like a ton of and i need like the drops from and i mean i still need to max out the rat beast jerry so all the pests are actually pretty good for me i like the spawn rate it doesn't really seem to be ruining like the flow of farming too too much one thing that I could see being detrimental is if you were to get like four or five pests during a farming contest, that could be quite catastrophic. So definitely make sure you take care of all the pests on your island or on your garden before a farming contest starts. But besides that, it's been quite chill and I'm actually kind of having fun hunting them down and hoping I get dropped. Okay, I think, but last time it told me I got a platinum, I, I didn't really. So let's see if it's being truthful today. I saved up some pests, so I had like an extra 50 from that. I just did the pumpkin contest. Let's see. Blizz. Platinum. It's beautiful. Why doesn't it show me diamond, though? I feel like it should show me that, you know? Either way, we we're just over the platinum limit, thankfully. My pumpkin farm is very scuffed, so it's chill, though. But we get a gold medal, a bronze medal, 30 Jacobs tickets, and a turbo book, as well as, um, yeah, if we go here now, we should have, yeah, see that little emblem or color beside the pumpkin? Did they end up actually adding the emblems to the game? Uh, would they be skill related? Achievement, maybe? Where would those be? It is. Requires platinum in all crops in Jacob's contest, and this one requires diamond. Okay, pretty cool. Not too shabby. Either way, uh, we will happily take that. What do I need for this? A stack of Jacob's tickets, two silver medals. Uh, I just don't think we have that right now. Let me see. 33. Two silver medals. Here's what I can do, though. I don't know if it'll be enough, though. How many tickets was that again? 30-something? I don't know if it'll get us there, but I'm, I'm still kind of tempted. I mean, what we can do is we can trade uh, one gold into four silvers. We can then sell a gold medal and sell two silvers in this bronze. Uh, that give us 20. I think we're short still. I think we're short. Yeah, we're five tickets short. Man, I, I really thought I got away with something there. Well, figured we may as well do a uh, composter upgrade. I need I need 2,500 um, copper set aside if we ever get that RNG drop. So I'm going to keep that. But that means we have 1,500 to play with. So we can go ahead and do a composter speed upgrade. We can do another one, actually. Let's go ahead and grab out four stacks of these. Bunch of enchanted carrots. What did it say? Eight enchanted golden carrots, I think it said. Perfect amount. Beautiful. And uh, let's go ahead and upgrade composter speed again. There we go. Another skyblock XP. Uh, we still have 800 uh, to play with here. I don't think I have enough for this still. A stack. Uh, 
No, I don't actually buy like a lot. I used a lot of mushrooms with uh, visitors. Oops. Tightly tied hay bale is what it wants for the next speed upgrade. We could do four enchanted baked potatoes. I can do that. Let's go and do that really quickly. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Hopefully I count that right. Four enchanted baked potatoes. Let's go and do this upgrade. Two polished pumpkins or a tightly tied hay bale. Uh, we can. I think we can do a tightly tied hay bale, right? 144. Yeah, we have enough. Okay, let's go ahead and grab out some of these. Tightly tied hay bale. Let's go ahead and do this upgrade. There we go. Another skyblock XP. And now we're into the the bigger ones for composter speed at least but yeah i want to stay on top of composter upgrades especially because it's it's that and visitors is what i need my crops for so ones that i have like an abundance of i mean i just need to focus on the composter if we ever want to max this thing i'm gonna be honest and i need compost a lot faster now i'm gonna be honest because i still need to unlock a bunch of plots uh, which is a little bit sad like i don't have all the plots unlocked and there's still a lot of skyblock xp to get there like 20 skyblock xp Still need all these corners, and I can't get that if uh, my composter isn't chugging along. So, I need to keep this guy going. Increased its speed by 140%, though, and we have a 15% chance for multi drops and 11% uh, cost reduction. So, pretty good upgrade so far. I'm gonna let him chug away, and uh, we do still have our 2500 copper saved aside in case we get lucky from those pests. And there we go, wheat 35. Hey, that is that's like a pretty impressive milestone number now, you know, like. It goes up to 46, so we have 11 more wheat milestones to go. Um, and yeah, we're we're cruising, man. We are cruising. Wait, why does this say 45? These are. Oh wait. Okay. They, so I was offline for a little bit. They rolled a thing now that shows your progress to the max. Oh, that's sick. Finally, like being able to visually see the end, like properly. Thank goodness. Wait, that's actually clean. Okay, cool. So yeah, we are now 48.6% of the way to max wheat. Um, some of the other ones we are we're quite far in some of these other ones. My goodness, see visualizing them like this is something. Um Wow. I I like this. I really like this. This is this is clean. Is wheat the one we're closest in? Wow, I've really done the most wheat. I, I guess that makes sense. I i I feel like I've definitely done like a lot of wheat, you know? 1% in cocoa bean is, is criminal though, I'm not gonna lie. So yeah, we have a, we have a lot of farming to do, but that's that's a really nice feature. I like being able to visually see how far away you are. Oh my god, look at the drops on this thing. Bookworm's favorite book and then Earthworm's and Ensemble Vinyl. Okay, wow. Uh oh, I already have that vinyl. That's that's actually funny. So yeah, we have two of the earthworm vinyl now, but we got one of the books, which can be applied up to five times to your vacuum. So that's really cool. Let's go ahead and slap one of these onto our vacuum then. Um, and yeah, this will give us an extra 10 damage. Don't mind if we do. There we go. We need four more of those things. Very nice. But yeah, I went ahead and uh, just competed in the contest. Actually ended up getting platinum. And uh, honestly, I, I was very close to um, diamond in that one. It was a wheat contest, which I feel like is one of my stronger crops. And uh, yeah, I was in like the top 3.1%, I think it's at the end. So not too shabby. Either way, let's head over to Jacob. Good to see you, bud. Yeah, platinum here. Um, not too shabby. That was also my personal best, which is super nice. So in terms of our personal best now, that's given me 39 wheat fortune, which is really nice. So I will happily take that. And yeah, we're working on participating in multiple farming contests, trying to get better uh, personal bests, obviously. That way we get more, literally more fortune for various crops. However, uh, how many tickets do I have now? This is the big question. 89. Wait, hold up. I actually cooked a little bit. So a stack and two silvers. And yeah, we can 100% just go ahead and upgrade our Anita's talisman finally to Anita's ring. Let's go. And, oh, I need to actually grab out the tickets. Go and do that really quickly. There we go. Go ahead and get the ring. Beautiful. Uh, let's go ahead and slap this thing back into our accessory bag. This will now give us an extra, this will give us 15 farming fortune for a random contest. So that's really nice. And that's also plus four skyblock XP. There we go. And uh, yeah, the last tier is two gold medals and 100 Jacobs tickets. I don't think I need this uh, bronze for anything. So let me go ahead and sell that bronze for some tickets. And uh, yeah, now next to wheat and pumpkin, we have that little platinum icon, which is super nice. So we're slowly but surely starting to get all of our platinums, which is always good fun. But yeah, doing my best to stay on top of all my visitors. Uh, a couple things I need to craft up for these people. 
and um yeah keeping the composter going but yeah these pests are pretty fun and i might be able to get the first tier of the pest talisman wait am i at 25 pests uh total pests exchange 19 i have three on me so okay now i need two more pests and then we can wait two or three more pests and i, I can get the uh the first tier of that accessory so that's pretty exciting and yeah overall we're just we're working our way through this we're having a good time and uh honestly i'm really enjoying the update i'm not gonna lie oh my first fly somehow uh yeah this one drops beady eyes which if i'm not mistaken is the bad reforged stone uh i almost want to double check that let's do slash hex is it clipped wings that's the good one or beady eyes that's the good one clipped wings is the good one beady eyes is the bad one Pests drop plus three crops doubles the damage dealt by vacuums yeah i just feel like clipped wings is infinitely better so uh yeah i mean if i get bd i guess i'll slap that on there for the time being but finally uh, it took us so long to get our first fly <laughs> i don't know why but uh yeah there we go not too bad okay i just found two more pests i didn't mean to hand in the five i did previously i was saving those for the next contest but i hand them in by accident so we may as well just keep adding on to that and hand in two more and uh, that is actually 26 pests, which allows us to get the Pest Hunter badge. Don't mind if we do. Let's go ahead and slap this into our accessory bag with that. Plus 9 Skyblock XP. Jeez, 1 Skyblock XP away from leveling up, which is so nice. But yeah, there's our two brand new accessories. They both need some work, but uh, that's what we're doing. I'm, I'm working on it. Okay, what do they want from me? And there we go. That is a Potato Milestone. We are now Potato Milestone... Is that 29 or 28? Yeah, 28. Not amazing, not terrible. We're getting there, but that did level us up to level 369. Not too shabby. We're the 67th Iron Man player to reach this milestone. And uh, yeah, 31 more levels away from 400, which is honestly insane. Just getting ready for a farming contest. I need to go ahead and take care of these pests I got. Let's do a warp garden real quick. Take care of these. That way I don't go over the uh, the limit. So I start losing farming fortune during my contest. That'll be very sad. Uh, let's see, where are these things? See this, this like plot hologram. I know you can turn this off, but I don't know. I like having it on sometimes, but a most of the time it just greased me. Also, this might just blends right into the netherworld, man. What the? All right, there we go. Tasty cheese. Not too shabby. And ooh, we got a little rat action going on over here. Swavy has made his way into my island on my garden. Ooh, rat six. Nice. Okay, uh, let me take care of this last visitor. That way I should have everything taken care of before this contest starts. And then we can uh, we can kind of just ball out and hopefully get at least a platinum at a minimum. That's like the uh, the actual min. Why did I just craft potatoes, man? What am I doing? My brain just shut off. I swear, whenever I do garden, my brain turns off 100 percent don't know why don't know how it just does either way uh there we go and we should be all set so i can kind of just plop myself into my farm and um let's hopefully get a platinum maybe even a diamond oh say i didn't do everything though i didn't hand in my i didn't hand in my pests guys you have to remind me of these things otherwise i forget oh my diamond in the potato contest low over 1.2 million potatoes that is my personal best i'm gonna be honest that was a terrifying contest, and I'll tell you why. As soon as we started, I had two, two of these freaks spawn. Like, it was, it was a double spawning. Uh, oh, wait, we got another vinyl. Man, the two vinyls I have, uh, what of? Okay, nice. Anyways, uh, yeah, I had two pests spawn literally two minutes into the contest. I was terrified. Ooh, a dung. Nice, and then we have one more pest somewhere. Where'd this guy spawn? Oh, somewhere over here, allegedly been wandering oh there he is hey buddy Ooh, slug come on give us a pet give us the slug pet oh no oh wait wait we actually got the slug pet no way oh my god these things are selling for 85 mil are you serious i was joking okay what that's like my second slug ever bro we're actually rng carried we're actually rng carried we get a diamond and potato and then reward with a slug pet a vinyl Oh my goodness. But yeah, look at this. Four or 8,000 uh, into diamond. or I, I, I don't really know what that number they're showing indicates. You know, I really don't. But either way, man, am I happy about that. That's beautiful. And um, I wonder if we have enough for this. It's 100 tickets. Let me go ahead and sell the silver like so. 100 tickets. Do we have 100 tickets? 
We do not. Okay, we'll, we'll have to work on that, but... Slug pet, what? Can I upgrade this thing? Let's go see. What's the upgrade price? Like, if, if it's cheap, I'll do it, but if it's expensive, maybe I wait and hope we get a legendary. I thought that was that greedy. Uh, a compost bundle and 10 mil. And takes 7 days. This is pretty tempting. Uh, let me see what the legendary perk is. No, you know what? I'm doing that. Who am I kidding? Of course I'm doing that. All right. I have everything gathered up. We need to uh, upgrade this thing. 9.97 mil and a compost bundle. Don't mind if we do. It's going to take seven days, but your boy came prepared. We got our cat flowers here. Let's go ahead and just feed this bad boy up because we are ridiculously impatient. Ready for pickup. There we go. Legendary slug. Okay, what's the bottom? When farming in the plot affected by spray in there, gain extra farming fortune. Okay, wait. That is good. Uh, yeah, the big thing though, um, grants extra bonus pest chance. And when fishing in the Crimson Isle, slugfish take a percentage uh, less time to catch. I'm pretty sure up to 100%, but let's go ahead and uh, equip this pet. 15 Skyblock XP. Don't mind if we do. There's our beautiful slug pet. Oh my goodness. And then who's the contact again that sells the 50% farming fortune, uh, like the, the pet item? It's one of the dungeon ones. I just can't remember which dungeon one. Uh, let's see if I can recognize the name from anywhere. No one on this page. Okay. Uh, Trevor, no. What is that guy's name? Oh my goodness, this is going to bother me. I have to find him. Is it Zog? No, there's no way it's Zog. It's not Tamioko. It's like Dustin or something. Like That's the name that's coming to head uh, or coming to mind. Who is this freak? Where where is he? Sells pet items. No. Oh wait, that Zog's the guy in the the B building. Who is he? Sell super boom. Traveling zookeeper. Um, uh, board bar board bartender. No. Blacksmith. More. George. Duncan. Duncan. That's what it is. What name did I say? I have no idea. Either way, one point five mil. Give me that. We're gonna go and slap this onto our slug pet. We have a new pet to level up and I'm excited. Um, all I did was accept my visitors. I did have a Jerry, but my slug went like all the way up to like level 46 just from visitors. I haven't broken a single block while having this bad boy equipped, but man, what a useful pet. The bonus pest chance is amazing. So uh, yeah, that's super helpful. Obviously I need to make sure I don't start a farming contest with this thing. That is my, my current biggest fear, I guess you could say. And, um, yeah, that's about it, though. Man, I'm, I'm pumped. I'm going to go ahead and spray the crops and uh, farm till the next contest. Maybe I'll do Nether Wart. There's no way I get Diamond in that, but I, I may as well, like, work towards a better PB just so it helps when I'm farming Nether Wart. I don't know. Uh, yeah, that, that one's that one's not going to be easy. I'm going to be honest. Nether Wart is going to be near impossible, but we can try our best. I could do another pumpkin, I suppose, but nah, I feel like doing nether wart. I really do, but it's going to be a struggle, like seriously a struggle. So that should be so much fun. Alrighty. Well, uh, another farming contest went by. This one was all types of scuffed. I started a minute late and then you guys, okay, this is just ridiculous. Um, I, my sack filled up with enchant seeds again, which is so great. So yeah, crops spewing out everywhere. I went ahead and crafted 30,000 enchant seeds into boxes of seeds. My goodness, can I ever craft a lot of these things? So I guess that's what I'll do. Uh, but like, man, you just, you get so many enchant seeds. Either way, we got a gold, barely. I was like right behind platinum, but my inventory was spewing out into my farm at the end. So that was fun. Um, either way, also look at that diamond and potato. That is so clean. That's so clean. Uh, I need diamond in all the crops, man. But we're going to go and trade one of our uh, golds for some tickets. And if I'm not mistaken... My goodness, we have eight extra. Let me go and grab out the uh, Talisman, the Anita's Ring, beautiful, and two gold medals, 100 Jacob's tickets, and the Anita's Ring. We can get the Anita's Artifact. Boom, another maxed out accessory. Obviously, I still need to recom this thing. Uh, we have some dungeons to do. We, we do indeed. Now, where does this thing go in line of succession here? Uh, it's going to be an epic one recommed. So I want to put like right at the end of the epics, I guess, right? So... Okay, we'll put it here. I'll move everything down. We'll move the chumming talisman away. Uh, let's slap that in there. Chumming talisman. Uh, let's move this one like so. Move this to the next page. But the ba boom. Slap that in. Plus eight skyblock XP. Don't mind if we do. And uh, yeah, that's another max accessory in terms of 
upgrading it, but I still need to put a recom on it, obviously, as I was saying. And uh, yeah, overall, quite successful. We'll take it. I know it was only a gold, but now the only thing we need is like better PBs. Like we don't actually need the tickets or medals for anything, which is kind of cool. So yeah, really satisfying having that part of the game max. Like don't need anything else from the shop. And uh, it's a really good feeling to have. Oh my God, what is my garden look? Atmospheric filter. Bro, what? Um, okay, I have a contest starting in 58 seconds, like a pest just spawned. I was like, oh, you know what, I'll go take care of this pest, why not? And, um, yeah, we're just dropping the filter, you know? That's, uh, that's chill. We got that and the slug pet, so I guess we've been pretty unlucky this update so far. I'm kidding, this thing's worth 133 mil, and did I mention my slug pet is also worth 140? Like, what? What is my luck? This is disgusting. I mean, we may as well get our Skyblock XP quick, I guess. Um, why not? Let's slap that in there with this. Plus 9 Skyblock XP. This thing's insane. We'll talk about it again after this contest. I need... I need uh, what? What is going on? What? My goodness, the RNG drops just keep on coming. Okay, I've just finished that contest. It says I finished Diamond. I'm gonna be honest, I think I'm I think I'm the person outside of Diamond, and uh, I, I'm pretty sure I know it, and it's a sad realization, I'm gonna be honest, it is a uh, sad realization to come to, but let's find this last pest, where's this last boy, oh my, bro is on the move, hold up, where'd he go, where's this thing, what the, what, how, how is he over here, where is he over here, okay, I'm confused, oh, there he is. Hey, buddy. Good to see you. Let's go and pick up this rat real quick. Beautiful. And uh, let's head back over here. So it says I got diamond. It's one of those things where I don't think I actually did. I knew it. I knew it. I must have been like the person outside of diamond. Ah, uh, See, don't bait me like this. Don't say diamond in chat then. Just tell me the truth. Tell me, tell me I just missed it. You know? Ah, uh, man. Yeah, I actually got teased. I got teased. Either way, we'll take it, I guess. Is that a new personal best for me? Uh, what, what did we get in that contest? That was 1,197,000 in carrots. Uh, that was our new PB. So we will take that. Some extra farming fortune. Also, one thing I want to talk about. This dude has been here all day, and he moves up with my uh, visitors. Like, watch this. If we, if we take care of a visitor so he can move up, like, let's make some room for him. Look at this. Oh? Did I catch him lacking for the first time today? Oh? Did, we, did, we, did I finally catch him? Oh my goodness, I caught him out. I caught him out. It's getting that late at night where I'm catching up the guy who's literally been on my garden the whole day. Basically what he's been doing is when I clear my visitors, he moves up forward with them. Uh, that is too funny. Jeez. Well, that's tough. This was your moment to shine, and you fumbled. Anyways, I think we need to talk about my RNG today. Uh, we got our hands on a slug pet, okay? We're going to go over some of the drop chances here in a sec. Not only that, we got our hands on a atmospheric filter, currently going for 133 million coins. It's the day of the update. I mean, technically, I dropped this the day after, 13 minutes past midnight, but... I think you guys get the point. This is insane, and this item is actually really good. While in your garden grants a buff depending on your current skyblock season. So currently it is spring, so it's giving me an extra 25 farming fortune. That's amazing. In the summer, 20 farming wisdom. Uh, autumn, pest spawn 15% more often. And in winter, visitors give 5% more copper. This thing's great. There's so many amazing buffs. Like, all the buffs are good, literally. So that's great. Um, pretty exciting stuff there. Then uh, let's go ahead and just look at some of these drop chances. Why don't we? Uh, so first and foremost, the slug. Our second slug we ever killed. We got a drop that is a 0.5% drop chance. That's insane. I will happily take that. Don't mind if we do. Probably one of the more important drops as well. Uh, then from a mite, we end up dropping the atmospheric filter. Now this thing is a 0.25% drop chance. So that's what? 1 in 400, I think? So insane. Once again, unlike our ninth, so that's that's good for us, I guess, right? That's like actually insane. I, I can't believe the drops we've gotten so far. Then we got one of the bookworm books, which we put on our vacuum. Like, 
everything's going our way this update so far we've been getting our hands on some pretty cool vinyls these things have dropped the price like crazy i think when i dropped my first vinyl it was going for like 13 mil now they're going for 100k similar things going to happen to my uh slug pets gonna go down price but right now this and the talisman are both worth like 140 mil each so that's like literally like 280 mil worth of drops we've gotten so far if i was on a regular profile i could have made but we aren't we're on iron man and I'll take what I can get. So I think that's going to be it for today's video. I've been playing the new update a ton. And uh, you guys will see a lot more videos about it. Let me know in the comments down below your guys' honest thoughts on the update. I'm going to be honest. The more I play this update, the more I like it. Like it, it makes Garden actually a lot more fun. I know it's just like going for these little pests. But the RNG drops I'm hunting down. Like maybe near the end of the B series it won't be as enjoyable. But I, I think as a whole this is like really solid. A lot more solid than I thought it was. But I'm really curious your guys' thoughts in the comments down below. So please let me know. Thank you so much for watching today's video all the way to the end. You guys are amazing. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe while you're here so you don't miss out on any future Iron Man uploads. Without further ado, I can't wait to see you guys in the next one. Use code Zach on the Hypixel store. Without further ado, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Take care and peace out.